All right, guys. <clears throat> Dwayne from Dwayne's Outdoors. Uh, I'm out here doing some squirrel hunting, and uh, hopefully I can get a rabbit too. We'll see. But today is 13 January, and I'm using a 20 gauge with a five shot, and uh, we'll we'll see how it goes. All right, stay tuned. It's pretty cold out today. 20. Four degrees right now. I'll walk through this grass and see if I can't kick up any rabbits. Well, I bet there's a few rabbits in there, but ain't gonna be any way to get to them. Holy crap! Oh, looks like we got some coyote dookie out here. It'd be nice to see one of those walk by. A lot of squirrel nests up here. hunting public land around Smithville going to a spot I hunted last year got two or three squirrels out of game trails going in there. I know there's rabbits in there. I ain't seen any rabbit signs in a long time around here. I know they're out here, but sit here and watch this area right here. So I'll uh, turn you off and I'll let you know when something comes up. All right, guys, <clears throat> no sign here. So I've given it a half hour. I'm going to move to another spot, and I'll get back with you. All right, guys. There's a couple squirrels playing around in the tree over here. I don't know how I'm going to get to them once I get them, but I'm going to get at least one of them.
getting hit. Look like a big red squirrel. If I wait a second, might have another one. It's gonna suck a little bit. Thorn bushes. Ow, right in my goddamn nose. God dang it. Hell, he's hunkered down. He ain't coming out. I'll find that one I downed. God dang it. All these thorns. All right. I'm going to turn you guys off for a minute. Yeah, nah, I'll leave you on. Screw it. jump down on that but I gotta get down there oh shit well everybody knows I'm coming now There's a fence there. All right. All right, I'm gonna turn you guys off so I can find this thing. All right, guys, I found my, my way through here. Found the squirrel pretty easy. He's right here. A little gray squirrel. Looks like a mix between gray and, and fox. So, looks like a male. But, uh, there's another one up in there. He's probably hunkered down for a while. I'm out here making noise. So, I'll uh, continue down this line and we'll see how it goes. All right, but there's that guy. <laughs> All right, guys, what I did here, what I did here was <clears throat> just circled back around where I killed that last one. I'm gonna walk this ridge again, just to see if I can't sneak up on anything down the, down the way. We'll see how it goes. It'd be nice if a quail popped out, or a rabbit. But I've already made some noise, so probably not gonna see that one squirrel again. Maybe I'll come in here and sit down and cool down a little bit. Yeah, I think that's what I'm going to do. Oh, thorny.
cool down for a little bit. Alright, turn you guys off for a minute. Alright guys, well I'm going to sit here for about a half hour or so. It's 11 o'clock. Sit here for a half hour and head back up to the truck. I got to get home and fix the wife's brakes, so I'm going to cut this short, probably 11.30 noon. But if I see anything come along, I'll turn you back on. Stay tuned. All right, guys, looks like we might have another one coming up. Yep, a little gray squirrel coming up. Get situated. might have moved around too much. Where'd you go, buddy? Shit. Suns in my eyes. All right. He's still over there somewhere. staying over there. Oh, they're definitely starting to run around more. A little warmer part of the day. Come over here where the sun's not in my eyes. Here he comes. I see his tail. He's still coming. And he's going to cross right in front of me. Got him. All right, well, let's go pick him up. Oy. Looks like another little gray squirrel. Oh man, these goddamn sticker bushes.
Alright. There he is. Ow. Come on, man. These guys just don't know when to let go. Two off of this ridge line I've taken. Let's see. Oh, man. All kinds of sticker bushes, man. Ooh, watch your hands. Off of this ridge line. Let's uh, sit here a little bit longer and see if I get another one. Sit back right where I was. Get over there, I'll put the squirrel in my bag. sitting right here. Oh, another male. Some fox squirrel. I think this would be the other one worth using. Yeah, he had spotted me moving and was just staring right at me. Luckily, I was able to get my shotgun up and take a take a shot. But this is what I'm doing to cart him out of here. Got a backpack, and then I got a plastic bag in here. situated and I'll uh, sit again for a few minutes all right guys looks like we got another one coming down the line all right guys looks like we have another one coming down the line let's hope the Sun stays out of my eyes this time it's not doing a very good job of it where'd he go oh there he is I'm better prepared this time. Yeah, crap. Where'd he go, buddy? There you are. I know I'm holding the shotgun weird, but... being very careful. Hell, he heard me talking. Let's see if he turns around and comes back. Doubtful. But he might. Oh, I wonder if he saw the gleam of this camera, damn it. All right, well, I'm gonna put you guys away for a little bit. Okay, guys. Uh, I put my phone away for a few minutes 
think about 10 minutes and this guy came came back so yeah that makes three so far I'll get back to you been a good day okay guys I think I had a pretty successful hunt uh, again this is public land out here Smithville Missouri um, came out here squirrel hunting saw one rabbit but too damn quick for me so I didn't get him but here's a little bit of my my bounty got three squirrels and this is what I take on me with me when my when I go do my squirrel hunting got a Remington 870 it's 20 gauge and then I take my TX 22 so that's what I carry him back in I got a little plastic bag that I wrap them up in you can get, use any Walmart bag or whatever wrap those up so the inside of my my go bag doesn't get all bloody but got the, got water on the side here keep in there you know a little food a little bit here and there like munchies trail mix whatever but yeah basically I do this you know for fun and uh, this is what I eat at work uh, I'm trying not to buy a whole, a whole lot of stuff from the store trying to process my own stuff it's healthier and I'm getting 45 so uh, getting up there in age I need to start taking care of myself a little bit better and uh, eating wild game is pretty dang healthy so that's where I'm at for now but uh, yeah this will conclude this hunt very successful all right thanks for watching